Yo guys, you're back in a new video. I'm sorry if my mic is very loud. It's just the audio. I need to go sh close my door. I'm sorry if my mic's loud. Just turn your volume down if you're listening to this. But this is another tutorial. This is how to make a good looking map for your game. Because everybody wants a good map. I'm going to show you just make that. It is very easy. So try this if you're if you're like if you're a starter, watch my other tutorials if you have not already. Cuz those ones help will help you get to this tutorial. Cuz though yeah, like you know. So just watch the other two tutorials, the part 1 and part 2 tutorial. Because if we did it, you would not know how to fix up your settings and all that stuff. But yeah, hopefully you have the right version down there. I, I use version 2021 because, like, you know, yeah. But okay, now, since just follow the last tutorial, I'm go, we're going to start game object. You're going to go to Pro Builder, like like the last tutorial, just, that's, that's how I showed you how to get all this stuff. Now you're gonna find your plane. You're gonna click this button right here, little button with the arrow. Now you're gonna pull the, this thing out, like whatever way makes it bigger. And then make it to like this, the right size you want it to be. I'll just use this, it's like a nice size. When you have your size, just click Open Pro Builder. And then it should appear like right here or something. If you see the name, you could actually like drag the name around like this. So, so you, know, you want to make sure that you can do this. Drag it like next to inspector, not like in inspector, next to it like this. See, let go, and boom, it's there. Now click on this little square with the lines. Now click. So you see how like if I hover over this, it's like turns yellow. Yeah, that's that's your that's what you need to do. So I just go to this or whatever you want. Now hold control while you're clicking other ones. Hold control when you're clicking these. Or else it won't work. So I'm gonna show you how to make a per, like a really good looking forest map. And if you mess up, do can do Control Z. So just hold Control and then click all of them. And when you have, just check when you have every single thing, like the whole thing, not 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 any of the middle. It's not like any one in the middle like that. Just click Control E. Control E on your keyboard and drag the arrow up. Control E. Control E. Drag it, drag it up to wherever you want. And then you're gonna can do Control E again, and you're gonna make this little thing. Click. You're gonna click Control E again. You should find this, and then you can like drag this up for like your top of the walls. Okay. Now once you have this, click the edges, all the edges, but but don't select all the edges. Just like when, just click one edge, then like one, just exactly in the corner, like one of the one of the corner ones, and then click, click hold the little green square cube right here, and make sure you're on the this selector thing, and you're gonna take the take it forward, and your balls aren't gonna be just like curved. Let's do that for every single one of them. Just like take them in. Take, oh, that's the, take it in, take it in, and then boom, it should look like this, oh, my thing is crashing, what is happening, I don't know, my PC is crashing, what is hap, I don't, bro, What the? I don't know what just happened. I don't know what the heck that was. But let me just drag this out again. It's unexpected. Hold on, I need to close out of this. What is happening? Why is my PC crashing? Guys, just give me a second.
There we go. Okay, now, if you just, I would, if you want to, keep, okay, now, the textures part. Or at first, just like drag these out wherever you want now. So click any of these, drag them in, drag them out, whatever you choose. You could, you could like use this little bottom part like I do. And like, so like I'm moving them out and in. So if you want to, you can speed this part up if you don't want to do this. This is the right tutorial to watch. I have very good experience with making games, like VR games and Unity games, whatever. And then, boom. Hold on, let me just. That's how you make your map. And now, if you want to get like textures, go to your thing. Like go what to whatever you use down here. Just open whatever you use, like your Chrome, Microsoft Edge, or whatever. And then search up online, and then like grass texture, wall texture, whatever. And just when you when you have it, go to your files. And wait, I'm gonna open my browser. I'm gonna show you how to get the picture. I don't know why my, my, my PC is being so laggy today. I don't know what it's doing. Well, okay, I'm just not gonna tell you. Well, I, I'm still gonna tell you. Right click when you find the right. Okay, I'm just gonna do it. Online. Just grass texture. Right click it. Do save as image and then just click save. On your files, and then go to your Unity project. So when you're, when you're on your Unity project, go to your files, go to your downloads, and you should find it. So drag, drag it into here, drag your texture in to your, uh, drag it into your game. And then when you have it in here, just drag it out, and then it should look like this. Click Control Z. And then go to resources, Gorilla Prefurbs, and then, well, okay, yeah, just go to resources, Gorilla Prefurbs, and then drag your Gorilla Rig on here. Because you need your Gorilla Tech, you need your Gorilla Rig, it's very important. Then go to this little flower here. Now drag it, like, wherever you want. This is where your player is going to spawn, so when you play test it, that's where it's going to spawn. Okay. Now, since you have your player model or whatever in here, now you're gonna texture it. So now you're gonna go to this little dot right here. Well, if, if you wanna like make the bumps in the ground, I'll show you how to do that. Just click the little dot. Now like move these up and down. Like move them all of them. I'm sure I'm gonna do it like this. Let me just I'm sure and if if it looks like there's like little dents in the wall, just use the dots up there. Okay, now when it looks like this, go back to your little face selection thing. Select all the ground things. Remember to hold control when you're trying to click another thing on Pro Builder. Hold control. I'm making sure I'm still recording. If the recording randomly stops, then I don't know. And I'll show you guys how to e make each map so my recording just doesn't randomly stop. So I want to select your all your your whole floor. Now go to your materials folder. Go to your materials folder. Just click Control Z if it disappears. Now when you're back here, drag drag your make make sure it is a ball texture. Drag it into there. Click off. And boom, and are on. Now you're going to do the walls. Just find your wall texture. Where did I put my wall texture? It's in here. Just get your wall texture, like online wall texture, and then do the same thing you did for your um, textures. Okay. Now when you're on this and you, f you find the ball, remember, you w when you find like the square picture, drag it on and then click Control Z. 
and then go to your materials folder you should find it like as like a ball texture uh. just hold control select all your other walls now drag the wall texture on boom and now you're gonna do these so select all these and just select them all this video might be like 10 minutes long I don't know eight I can, I'm not checking the recording right now at the end of the video I will when you have them selected just drag your wall texture on make sure it turns black or whatever and boom that's how you make the map for your fan game well I hope you guys liked it it's a 10 minute video well yep that's it so I'll see you guys in the next video peace out well next tutorial video peace out everybody